Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, it's me, Robin, again. So, to take you guys through the type of different therapies I've gone through and currently still doing, is this is the one I started with first. Uh, first, I went through spinal decompression and uh, chiropractic care. As you can see here, uh, the, the chiropractor is performing his uh, typical adjustment where we would do right before every every single spinal decompression therapy first I would start by warming up my lower back for like 15 minutes with a heat pad and then I'd go into this adjustment very similar to this one and then we would go into spinal decompression with a machine called the DRX 9000 so I started uh, spinal decompression back in August 6th that was the first day that I got my first spinal decompression and the plan originally was to do 20 sessions where the first week I did five sessions and the following week it was five so the first two weeks was already half of the of the program and then after that it was three three two and two and by then it was already 20 from here we decided to extend the program longer since I was having a lot of issues still but by this time I was able to walk as of before I was completely bedridden and I mean I couldn't even sit due to the amount of pain uh, I was really just completely in pain and just couldn't move forward from a point but halfway through the decompression therapy I started doing little things such as like sitting for like 10 to 15 minutes and from there progressed obviously and we decided to extend the program for a couple more weeks which I'm still doing right now first we decided to take a couple weeks off so my lower back can can take a break So this is the DRX 9000. This is the machine that performs the spinal decompression therapy. And what this machine does, it is isolates the discs that is herniated or is bulged uh, protrusion. And what it does, it spreads the spine apart for a couple minutes and then it relaxes it. It's uh, similar to traction, but traction keeps your spine apart and when that happens uh, the muscles have a tendency to close in because of the gravity but here it, it spreads it out and then releases it which causes uh, your your muscles not to fight back not everybody qualifies for this treatment depending on your chiropractor he tests you before trying this treatment out and as you can see right now it's pulling my spine apart and you, if you see those top hills is where it peaks and then it lowers down so you can you can let your lower back rest a little bit any questions about spinal decompression therapy just leave a comment below and i'll get to you as soon as possible thank you